Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to my channel. This is Cindy with Nets of Hope. Welcome all you new subscribers. This is a quick message and it is the same video as yesterday, but I want to add some information to it. Let me go ahead and get right to the news of uh, this particular letter from my sister Vivian and I have gotten more than one since I've been on my channel. Uh, one I aired and some were private. They were personal. They were just for me from the Lord. Does the Lord speak to everyone in sentences and letters? No, he does not. Many people will think, oh, well, if you're not hearing from the Lord, something must be wrong with your relationship with him. Yeah, I could say that there might be something wrong with your relationship with him, but I do hear words and I hear sentences. I do not hear paragraphs and letters. I think the Lord God has special gifts and he has reasonings for giving certain people letters and paragraphs and certain people words and sentences, visions and dreams, and that's who I am. I'm a watchman and you can believe it or not. I don't really need you to believe it, but I, I pray that you would use godly discernment. I'm not here to be your prophet. I'm not here to be your... Um, your spiritual um, advisor as to your godly discernment, that's your job to pray. That is your job to pray to have godly discernment. Anyway, letter from Vivian, uh, from the Lord, daughter, write this down. You are in great danger. Pick up your bags and run double time and do this now. You, your world is upside down for many to fall. Speak and say these words. Doom ya do. Neighborhoods are cloaked with ash. Boom ya do. Safe havens under cannot be touched. Run, I say. Write this down and speak it to all. Tick tock. Yeshua Hamashik. Okay, now then... As I was praying yesterday, um, the Lord was revealing to me because I was asking him, Lord, that I know of, there's no safe havens. But the Lord is pointing out to anyone and everyone in New York City, I've never been there. I don't know what your transit system is like. But these safe havens under, under, cannot be touched. Run, I say. He's basically showing you that underground in your transit system is going to be the only way you're going to survive the atomic blast. Will it be a living hell down there? Yes, it will once the blast starts. But whenever the blast does start and you hear it, you only have, from what I've studied on YouTube, on videos, you have six to 10 minutes or less, depending on how close you are to the impact, to get to the subways and get underground. Okay, that is your safe haven to protect you from the, um, the nuclear blast, the nuclear burn, and possibly the nuclear devastation, life or death, or a horrible death situation. So, uh, anyway, he said for her to write this down and speak it to all, tick-tock, Yeshua Hamashiach. So he's basically telling us, time is ticking, that these events will happen. Boom, ya doom. This is, boom, ya do. That means it's going to be a bomb. This all equals the vision the Lord God gave me. I will do another video. I have to end this. But it says, doom, ya do. Neighborhoods are cloaked with ash. That matches the city that the Lord God showed me on fire. And uh, it had horrific smoke above it. And people were driving out of the city with thick smoke and their headlights on. So I'm going to end this video for now so I can get it downloaded. I love you. And I have ended comments on my channel. I'll describe more in detail a few videos down. Love you.